Welcome back to my channel, everyone. So I'm going to be doing a, another Nightmare Before Christmas video here today. And it, it is the review video of a pop that I just recently picked up. And it is the Nightmare Before Christmas barrel pop that I picked up recently. Um, to add to my Nightmare Before to add to my Nightmare Before Christmas collection. I do not have Barrel as a pop in my collection, so this is the first time he will be adding to it. I also do have three of them pre-ordered at GameStop. I do have Lock, Shock, and Barrel, but for some reason, I haven't been able to pick that up yet because they haven't got any of them in as I pre-ordered it for about two months ago. But once I do get that, I will be doing a separate video of that one. But for now, I have Barrel. He is separately... Uh, he is by himself, so there is no lock and shock with him. But I did pick this up at Newberry Comics um, for about, I think, $14. A little bit pricey for one pop, but usually they do charge a little bit pricey for their pops because they are known for it. So let's take a look at the packaging. So up top, it does say pop. It is Disney. It is number 408. Then on the bottom, it does say barrel. And then in the back... It tells you the rest of the characters inside the collection. So you do get 209 Sally Seated, which I think I do have that one. They do have number 211 as the Bohemoth, which he's going to be the rarest one to find, I feel like. Then they do have Lock, Shock, and Barrel, which, by the way, you can buy these two separately. But I've never really seen Barrel by himself. So that's so I've never really seen Barrel by himself. So that's the first time I saw him by himself. And... Lock Shock, I never send, I never saw them separately either. But like I said, I do have a set of these three pre-ordered, uh, which I am waiting for GameStop to give me the notification so I can pick it up at my nearest store. So I will be doing an unboxing video of that over time. But this one I'm going to keep inside the box just because I don't want to open him. So I'm going to leave him inside the box. So as we see him inside the box, he looks really detailed. There is Beryl as he's smiling, wearing his mask. And then he's got his lollipop in his hand as well. So a really detailed pop, but I am going to leave this inside the box. I am going to be displaying this on my shelf. Um, I could open it, but I do want to open up the three of the lock, shock, and barrels that I have pre-ordered at GameStop. So those I do want to open. But for this one, I'm just going to leave this one inside the box and display it on my shelf. So there it is. There is the Nightmare Before Christmas barrel pop that I picked up um, to add to my Nightmare Before Christmas. Christmas collection. So thank you for watching and I hope you guys enjoy.